Hello guys, if you have some issues with Cortana using much resources or slowing down the computer, we will go ahead and permanently disable it. So we have no direct option to disable it, that's why I'll tell you the easier step to disable it because uh, if we compare Cortana with Alexa or Google AI, Cortana stands nowhere. So, and even it slows down the computer sometimes. There are many users who complain. So let's get rid of it. I'll tell you the easier way first if you're using Windows 10 Pro or Enterprise. And the second step will be for all kinds of windows. All right. So the easier one is just press Window and R together on a keyboard and type gpedit.msc. You can pause it and note it down. Once you've done it, just click on OK and a new window will appear. I'll just maximize it and I'll just drag this so that I can see properly. Now here in the left hand side do you see the administrative templates? So we just have to expand it and here we need to click on Windows Components. Now here look for search. and the moment I click on search I find allow Cortana so you just have to do a double click and click on disabled click on apply and OK hooray we have disabled it so now if you go ahead and check Cortana um, it will be open but there will be no options so you it will not be using any resources of your computer. Now let's go for the second way which is for all kinds of Windows 10. So for that we just need to press Window and R and this time we are typing Reg Edit. Reg Edit and hit Enter or click on OK. It will ask you to say yes so we will just click on yes and I'll just maximize it and I would recommend to you as well to maximize now here just allow me a quick minute now here we need to go to H key local machine and I'll just expand it by clicking on the right arrow key and then we are going to software now in the software we are looking for policy so here I have found the policies I just have to click on that right arrow key to expand it and here we're looking for Microsoft and then again in Microsoft we are looking for Windows so you just have to select Windows no need to expand it just click on Windows and here we just have to t uh, do a right click at the right hand side and click on key and here we will type Windows search and hit enter now here we just have to do a right click and go to new and select D word 32 bit value and here we just have to type allow make sure you type the exact way I'm doing it A capital and C capital allow Cortana and then I'll just do a right click and click on modify and put the value 0 here and hit on OK so by giving a value 0 is actually disabling it and if I type 1 here and click on OK it will be activated. So in this manner you will be able to activate or deactivate permanently the Cortana and let me know in the comment section if you have any issues. Hit the like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day.